The 12-year-old Shuja Kennedy did not die in vain. Let their blood not have flowed in vain. There are people who left their homes in the morning and never made it back. There are people whose bodies were riddled with bullets. People who will never walk again. They sacrificed their limbs and their emotions and their organs that we may have a better country. For their sake, let their blood not have fl flown in vain. We cannot take this from a regime that does not want to listen. A regime that claims dialogue, but dialogue is a preserve of the political class. When they want to dialogue with the clergy, they do it in open camera. When they want to dialogue with each other as political class, they do it on our taxpayers' money, sometimes in resorts. But when they want to dialogue with the youth, it is on the point of a gun, at the other end of a baton looking stupid, or we are found in swamps, floating, tortured, dead. If you dare raise your voice, you are abducted and killed. As a young person, I'm urging you to rage on. The older generation that is here with us have supported us consistently. They are giving us information and equipping us. But let us not be detracted from the rage that is going on because the rage is not a call to disorder. It is not a call to ban our country. It is a call to proper governance. Rage on, march on. And when you say Ruto must go, you know clearly the issues that we are fighting is a lack of meritocracy. We have seen them pride themselves in tokenistic things where they want to appoint first female things. But that is setting us back ways in which we will never be because we can never take these tokenistic appointments seriously. Rage on because they are pissing on your intelligence that once they give us a youth, we find that we can trace them as a proxy to a person who's bearing a case. We said dissolve, not reshuffle. He did exactly that and still gave us people who constitutionally should not even be nominated. He might be playing a long game to try and show us that he has assuaged us because we know the executive has captured the legislature and he might take the names so that they are rejected at the legislative level for him to pass off as a person of good governance. We declare that we have seen through that ruse. As a young person, if you're listening to the sound of my voice, rage on. Do not accept your future to be sold out by political prostitutes, people who deal with the lives of millions. And I have said time without number, corruption is akin to genocide. When you take money that belongs to young mothers, you are killing millions of generations. Kaskazini, you can, you can wind up. You can wind up. As I wind up. As we plan to occupy, as we plan to continue to exercise our democratic rights, as we plan to implement our constitutional rights, do not be coward. I am calling you to unity. There will be a lot of dis dis distractions. There will be a lot of detractions and small talk. But when the political class unites, remember that they will use everything they have, which is weapons, money, and the minds that they have at their disposal. Do not let anyone whole with your future. Rage on. Okay, um, thank you so much. For